Okay, to get started, I added some text to my Photoshop document, and for this trick, we'll actually be adding multiple drop shadows that fade together to give it a really nice look. Let's begin by double-clicking your text layer to open up the layer style settings. In here, select the drop shadow option, and you'll also want to make sure its box is checked so it's enabled. Alright, we want our first shadow to be pretty light, so reduce the opacity to 15%. We also want it far away, so set the distance to 75 pix. And finally, set its size to 65 pix, so it covers a lot of area. Next, click the Drop Shadows Plus button to add a second drop shadow. This time, decrease the opacity to 13%, and make sure you have Global Light turned on so that your shadows blend together. Then change its size to 50 pix, since we want each new shadow to get closer to our text for the fade. Now let's add another drop shadow by clicking a current shadows plus button. For the third one, we'll just decrease the distance to 20 picks to move it closer to our text. Next, let's add one final drop shadow, which will make it our fourth one. Increase its opacity to 25, since we want this closest one to be more visible, making our text pop. Change its distance to 15 to bring it even closer to your text. And decrease its size to 30 picks. Okay, this looks good to me, but based on your preferences, you may want to play with the settings of this closest drop shadow. For example, if you want it to be darker, you could increase the opacity more. This is the one that's supposed to stand out more, whereas the others contribute to a nice fade effect. Once you're finished, be sure to hit OK so that it applies the shadows to your text layer. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.